this day, God, we pray that you'll keep your hand upon the judges, the horses, the handlers, the dogs, the marshals, and everyone, and give us all safe travels. Thank you for already keeping us safe as we came this morning or traveled in the last couple of days. Once again, we thank you for your many blessings. And God, we'll never forget who breathed the breath of life in us when we became a living soul. We'll never take it for granted. I'll give you the glory, the honor, the praise, and everybody say in Jesus' name, amen. 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 <laughs> hey, we're down here in New Concord, Kentucky. My man, Mike Manny. Uh, Mike, how did this come to be? Well, it's all started where when, you know, as everybody knows, I've handled dogs for several years, me and my family, yeah. and the sport has been good to us. Mm -hmm. And I've always wanted to do something like this, but with me with handling dogs, it's kind of impossible. Okay. So, you know, I stopped handling dogs at uh, trials, still conditioned dogs, but it sounded like a good time to get this dog to handpicked members from all over the place that I've watched, you know, throughout my career that's really hustled, tried to make their clubs better, and that's the guys I want. Okay. And from there, we recruited them, and here you go. I mean, biggest trial in the country. Yeah, so if you don't know, this is the biggest SPO trial in the country. It's just been going since 2021, and they're averaging about, what, close to 400 entries? Our first, no, our first year, I, this this is not a correct number, but okay. I, I'm thinking we had around 280 something 280 dogs. 280 your first year. Last year, which is our second year, we set the bar 348 total. 348. Dogs. If y'all don't know, that's a huge trial. That's huge. That's I mean, huge. And then today, on our first day, we had was it 198? 198. 198. We had 100 and uh, nine, big. nine big ones, and then 89 little ones. Something like that. Right. Yeah. And so almost 200 on your first day. Mm -hmm. I mean, right. that, that's huge. Now, Mike, when I first met you, were you coming up out of Texas? I'm. I was originally from this area, okay. this county on the other side of the county is where I was born and raised. Uh -huh. I moved to Texas out of high school. Okay. And of course, where I met Linda, married, and that's where I started my trialing career. Yep. 2001. Yep. Is yep. when I started. Yeah. When I first met Mike, I remember he was coming out from coming up from Texas. Right. And I was thinking, man, don't nobody run dogs in Texas, you know. But <laughs> <laughs> that's about the end of the line, right there. Right, that's, that's it. That's pretty far west that's, from where we're from. That's it. But hey, man, I'm glad you came over here to the middle part of the country down here in Kentucky. You guys are doing some big things down here, man, and we appreciate the way that you're giving back to the Beaglers. Now, how, how many clubs run out of this uh, pr uh, spot right here? As of right now, there's four clubs. Uh -huh. uh, last year, we let river city come in and run their season mr mark west passed away okay uh where they ran we let them come here until they got their ground situated okay and they won't be here this year but we run little river bigel club west tennessee kenton bigel club and of course blood river which we only have one trial and this is it right here. right well hey for anybody's out there if you run an spo style dog or even if you don't run an spo trial style dog you can still come over here and give it a shot once a year 
plenty of giveaways, best prizes in the country. You got to come down here and check us out. New Concord, Kentucky. Blood River Beagle Blowout 2023. Thanks for watching. There you go. Yes, sir. Hey everybody, here we are judging 15 inch females at the Blood River Battle Blowout. Yes, sir. This is my man Leslie Fisher out of uh, what, Columbia, South Columbia, Carolina? South Carolina, Capital City. Yeah, Game Cox. Yeah, you can see by the, the, the shirt, man. It's, it's thick out here today. You see? But we done seen some good females. You don't uh, get this right here by walking in the aisle. <laughs> We're uh, what, 11 packs into the first series? That's right. 11 packs into the first series. We got 109 fem big females to judge today. We're uh, a little over halfway through. What time is it, Leslie? What time you got? I ain't got no watch. Hold on one second. It's 2.20. We're a little more than halfway through. We'll probably be here tomorrow to finish up big females. But we've seen some good ones today. It's a little thick, a little hard to judge. But uh, you know, we're getting through it. We're having a good time. Have a great time. But, hey, good to see everybody. If you didn't make it out here, make sure you come out here next year. Good people, good fellowship, good running. We having a good time at the Blood River. Peace. So here, everybody, we're here with Brian McBride. Brian, where y'all up? 
I'm out of uh, West Tennessee, up in the Dyer County area. Okay, okay. Uh, hey, well, Brian McBride just won the big female class here at the Blood River Beagle Blowout. 109 big females, the biggest female class that anybody's ever heard of. Brian, how do you feel? <laughs> Man, it's great. It's, it's great. It's great, man. I'm getting cold. I'm getting chill bumps as I speak to you right now. Uh -huh. uh, this little, this little bitch here. She's a, she's a total package. Yeah. You know, she's actually my first field trial dog I've ever had. Man, that's amazing. So, if you don't know, I, I judged uh, big females today, so I watched her. You all day yesterday and watched her half the day today, and I'll tell you what, solid every time we've seen her. Brian, she is, she's a solid dog, and for you to get in the field trial and get a dog like that is pretty special. Yes, it is. Yeah. Now, do you do you rabbit hunter? I do. I rabbit hunt. That's okay. how I got started in it. Uh, had a couple buddies in the field trial circuit, and um, I had a daughter that played uh, uh, travel softball, okay. and it kept me busy on Saturday. Yeah. She graduated high school, moved on from the softball, and I knew that I wanted to get into something that would occupy my time and nothing no better than following behind these hounds. Wow, that's good. So how, how long have you had her? Have you had her since she's a pup? Uh, she'll be, yes. Okay. Yes, I, uh, I own her mother and I, and I bred her to a dog named Throttle. Okay, is that so, yellow, yellow Rock Kennels Throttle? Yellow Rock. Okay, yeah, I'm familiar with that dog, yeah. Nice dog, real nice dog. Yeah. Okay, so you've had her since, how old is she now? She will be three the first of the year. Wait, Brian, huge congratulations, man. You just won the biggest female class ever in the history that we have, of modern history of the SPO, man. Super nice dog. Congratulations, man. Appreciate it, buddy. Appreciate great. you looking at that. All right, man. Thank you. Thank you.